All right, real quick, we're gonna show you how to put together a down and dirty homestead kill cone without going and buying the expensive kill cones. You grab yourself a five gallon bucket and you cut it and you zip tie it together and it makes a kill cone. So right, there's a kill cone and you just screw it into your, um, wherever you're gonna hook it up to, drop the chicken in there and you have a kill cone. So let's get into it. So I can cut the bottom off. Cut down the side. I take and cut an angle real quick back this way. We take the angle part, we fold inside, and we roll it. So where it takes a little bit of muscle here. Get the bottom the size that you want it. I like to be able to put my fist in it and that's about it. And then you screw, you take and drill yourselves two holes right here, Will. All right. Feed the zip tie through. From the outside to inside, keeping this, the inside of it smooth. And then we do one more hole out on the outside here to make a third spot. So there's three holes kind of in a diamond shape down here just to hold this in place. Good deal. And then we just throw a series of, the, of double holes up along here to keep it all in place here. Should be about six or seven zip ties total. Five gallon bucket, down and dirty. Just bring it all together then. No, is it tight there, Will? Go ahead. Excellent. I got this one. Go ahead and get that one. So in just a couple minutes, you can get one of these thrown together if you have the five gallon bucket, some zip ties and a drill bit and save yourself a bunch of money. And if you're not doing them all the time and you're just doing a couple times a year, these have worked out great for us. We've used the first set of them multiple years and we just store them outside so it's not like we even take care of them super well because they're pretty easy to make. And then the only thing I do is look inside right here is there's a, it gets kind of held out here. So I just put a couple right through here and right through here to hold it in place in there. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six zip ties right here that we're gonna put in total. And one more. See the shadow right there? So like I said, everyone's got a broken five gallon bucket laying around. You've got hole, you've got cracks in the bottom, you've got holes in the bottom. It's totally fine because you can just chop them off and go ahead and use that bucket there. So we're a great way to use your buckets and to save a bunch of money on kill cones. That is what it looks like when it's all done. You just hold it up there, drill it in, drop your bird in there, and the head comes out there. Kill cone.